One of the most important rules in all of economics is that you produce up to the point where marginal revenue equals marginal cost. So let's show why this works. So I've got quantity that they're producing. I've got the price that's being charged. This must be a perfectly competitive market if this price is remaining constant. And then I've got total revenue. Total revenue is just the amount of money brought in. So it would just be price times quantity. So they're selling nothing. $5, obviously total revenue is $0. One at $5, they bring in $5. Two at $5, they bring in 10 on down the line. Next column is marginal revenue. Marginal means each additional. So what's the additional money that they're bringing in as they sell one more? Well, it's $5. Between here and here, went up by five. Here and here, went up by five. Here and here, went up by five again. So marginal revenue is $5 all the way down the line. Next, I put in total cost. Total cost, just how much it's costing for them to produce zero, one, two, three, four, five on down the line. Next, I've got marginal cost. Marginal just means each additional. So from here and here, $2. Here and here, it costs an additional $3. Here and here, it costs an additional $2. Economists always say that you uh, make decisions at the margin. You think about marginal cost, you think about marginal revenue when they're deciding if they should produce one more. So let's look at it. Um, profit then gap between the total revenue and the total cost gives us our profit and we can see that profit is maximized when they produce five units so yes the business's main idea is to maximize profits but we could also use the rule where MR equals MC to make this decision as well so look at the numbers would we spend two additional dollars uh, to make five additional dollars, yes, we would do that. We would also spend three to make another five. We'd spend two to another two dollars to make another five. We'd spend two dollars to make another five. We'd spend four dollars to make another five. But nobody would spend six dollars just to make another five dollars. So we would produce up to this quantity right here, five units, where also our profits are maximized at twelve dollars. So again, the rule that we're following, as long as marginal revenue is greater than or equal to marginal cost, we'll still produce. On the graph, you want to look for the point where marginal revenue is equal to marginal cost. This is where we find the optimal quantity and the price that the business uh, should be producing at.